ni katika cheo za jengo hili katikati mwa mji wa Embu ambapo mwili wa mwanamke mmoja ulipatikana. Jamaa na marafiki wakifika hapa nyuso zikiashiria majonzi. Kushuhudia mwili wake ukibebwa na maafisa wa polisi walioitikia wito wa wananchi. Mwanamke huyu aliyekuwa muuguzi katika hospitali ya Kiritiri katika kaunti ndogo ya Mbere Kaskazini inadaiwa kuwa alifariki baada ya kutumia kupita kiasi dawa za kutuliza maumivu. Akithibitisha kisa hicho Mshauri wa kisaikolojia wake Liza Gota anasema kwa mwenda zake alifika katika kliniki yake kwa huduma za kawaida ila hakumpata. Mwili wake ukipatikana baadaye chooni kando ya pakiti ya dawa inayosemekana kuwa alitumia. She called me at around 2:40 and I told her to give me some time. When I arrived at 3:20 she was lying in the toilet. We discovered some the some of the drugs she was uh, she had uh, injected herself Aidha Liza na Kiri madai ya mteja wake kujitia kitanzi huku akisema kuwa mwenda zake alikuwa akiugua ugonjwa wa kiakili kutokana na matatizo ya kifamilia She didn't commit suicide as people are saying in the town She has been having a problem which I can't disclose as a counselor she has been abusing a drug a medical drug it was a, a an, an is this a, no analgesic that was very strong so she got addicted to it It is true she had a bit of marital issues which we were dealing with. Kisa hicho sasa kinaibua maswali kuhusu afya akili na umuhimu wa kutoa hamasa kuhusu kuepuka msongo wa mawazo. Let us sensitize the young couples to deal with their issues in a more amicable manner. Let us not leave wives that are suffering. Let relatives come in and help out even the pastors let them come in and bring couples together wale weko na wanaona kama wanakuwa na mambo ya kinyumbani ama mambo mazito mazito kaidi look for somebody who you can talk to mwili wa marehemu lisafirishwa hadi hospitali kuu ya embu huku maafisa wa polisi wakianzisha uchunguzi kubaini kisa cha kifo chake lameka guturuninga k24